Okay, so that, yep, there's Conrad, chilling. Uh, yeah, where is it? L? No, P? No, O. No, Mark Hall's view, please. You, that's the one I want. There we go. There we go. Alright, Nemesis is maxed out now. Oh, <laughs> uh, you can say something? If it gets out of hand, I'll squash it. Welcome back, Earth Clan. Will you be needing supplies for your return to the colonies? Show me what you've got. Most excellent. As long as things I'm don't sure get out of you hand, will find I'm something fine. pleasing. Generally. As long as it's not, you know, horribly, horribly racist. Damn, that's expensive. Well, I might as well get it. There we go. Hey, Commander Shepard, it's me. There are rumors on the extranet that you've been made the first human specter. That's incredible. Being a specter is a big responsibility. I just want to make humanity proud. The vids are all talking about Commander Shepard fighting for all of us back home. And your grace and skill have inspired a whole legion of admirers, too. Hey, can I get your picture? Sure. I don't have a problem with it, but why? Are you kidding? Nobody will believe that I talked with the beautiful Commander Shepard unless I get a picture. Just hold up your gun. Perfect. Thanks again, Commander. I'm gonna hang this in my living room. My wife will love it. I can see her having a point of not wanting to run the risk, but if you compare a risk of 1 out of 50 to develop a heart condition, or 1 out of 300 to develop other things, logically speaking, go with squashing the, you know, the risky bits. Where am I going now? Clinic, right? Conrad, check. Yeah, clinic. Yes, Dr. Michael. There we go. And like I said, I actually personally have a genetic heart problem. So, <laughs> my view is a little tainted in that, yes, I would have liked genetic treatments to have avoided this. That would have been nice. I never properly thanked you for saving me from Fist's thugs, Commander. I don't know what would have happened if you hadn't been there. I'm just glad you weren't hurt. Me too. Now, was there anything you needed? You're a doctor. How did you end up here on the Citadel? My parents brought me here when I was young. My father was a medic with the Alliance. I chose to keep the medical tradition alive, but not the military. Fixing up wounded soldiers isn't my idea of fun. You're a doctor. Okay. I chose to keep the medical Let me take a look at Of course. Okay, so I needed to talk to her. That's nice. Holy crap, she's got a lot of medical in interface stuff. I mean, having plus two health regen a second is kind of nice. I mean, that's ridiculous. But look at the price of this thing! Okay, well, let's sell that. Alright, I'm going to sell a bunch of just gibberish. I have way too much stuff and I just... Look at this! Look at this. Look at this. I want you to see that this is the uh, scroll. Well, we're going to see if I can get there, Nate. I'm just going to sell all this crap. And we're sailing away. You see, I, I'll play the odds, generally speaking. But, good god. Okay, I'm not there. I'm not at Medical Exoskeleton. Which is real nice. Yeah, <laughs> I know, right? I could get that, but I'd rather get that. Because 15% reduction in power? I mean, I can afford Medical Interface 7. But medical exoskeleton... Yeah, look. Yeah, no. The sell all would be nice, yes. Okay, so she's not giving me the quest. So apparently, if I go back to Fist's office, I can come 
back and it'll trigger it. So we're gonna go to Korra's Den and see if I can go back into Fist Office, which according to a wiki that I read I should be able to. And then kind of go from there. Yeah, sell all button would be real good. Yeah, we just need to do this. So this one, this side quest, apparently will allow me to hire Dr. Michaels as my Normandy... Um, my Normandy doctor in ME3. <laughs> which will then free up... Uh, it will free up Dr. Chakwas, which will give me more stuff. Okay, so yeah, fist office, look around. Looks like everything's clean and clear. Alright. And now I should be able to go back, talk to her, and trigger the quest. Hey, Harkin. If I could, I would shoot you in the face. But don't worry, Harkin. I'll see you later. <laughs> I'll see you later. Okay, then. What am I up to? Alright, now let's go back to the medic. To the med clinic. I never noticed that there's actually a, uh... Oh, here we go. Here's something a little different. Yeah. I need those supplies for my clinic. I can't. You can and you will. Or your story won't stay secret for long. Don't disappoint me, Doctor. Okay. Oh, Commander Shepard. I didn't see you come in. Need some help? Every time I come in here, I see someone threatening you. Who was that? Someone from my past. I can take care of it. I might be hey, able to help Great you. Red. Welcome. I was fired by my previous employer for giving out free medical supplies to clinics like this. They never filed any charges. They just wanted me to leave without any fuss. But somebody must have found out. Now they are blackmailing me. That's not I good. have to give them what they want. If the board finds out about my past, I could lose my license. They'll shut my clinic down. Oh, let me go, uh... Maybe I can get you out of this. Take care of business. Tell me what they want. I have to give some of my medical supplies to a merchant in the markets. They expect delivery today. Please. Give me your contact's name. I'll deal with this guy, whoever he is. Deal with him? But won't they expose my past? I'll make sure they don't tell anyone. Crack nuts. I was told to speak with a merchant named Morlan down in the markets. I really appreciate this, Commander. Thank you. No problem. Don't worry. I'll take care of this. Good luck, Commander. Be careful down there. <laughs> she, uh, she had a bit of a wild experience in college. You know, really, really explored her roots. Basically. You know, and I am all about the free love in college. I approve of all of it. Okay, so Morlin, is he up here? I don't believe he is. I think Morlin is downstairs. There's also one more trigger for Conrad, but I can't do it until I clear Pharos. So that is, that is going to be, you know, the next main mission. Hello there. Welcome to Morlin's famous shop. You want many good supplies, yes? Let me see what you have. Love is love oh, until you will be pleased, fired. I think. Very good things I have. You will see. Let me see my standard armors. Very nice, Great Red. Now you just got, what, like 12, 13 more? <laughs> Hello there. Welcome to Moreland's famous shop. You want many good supplies, yes? You got like 12, 13 more bucks of the same length. You were expecting a delivery of medical supplies. But I was told the doctor would be bringing them. Things have changed, Marlin. A change, but the doctor... I don't... This is not right, human. Shut up, Marlin. I told Baines you'd screw this up. What the hell's going on here? Who are you? Leave the doctor alone. We can end this if you just bring me those supplies. 
Otherwise, I'll start telling people about the doctor's little secret. Oh god, I'm seriously tempted right there. You're shutting down a medical clinic. What if someone needs treatment? What if you need treatment? Hey, hold on! I'm just the middleman here. This is way more than I bargained for. <laughs> He's like, I don't, I don't want to deal with this. Thank you, human. It is good to see him humbled so. What do you know about Baines? I have never met him, human. I only worked with the one who spoke with a doctor. What do you know about Baines? I have never met him, human. I only Goodbye. worked with the one. Yes, all right then. Good. All right, so I think we go back and talk to Doctor Michael. Tidings yep. to you, human. All right, let's go find out who Baines is. And yeah, Wheel of Time. Oh God. I've actually started reading um, the Aeon's Gate by Sam Sykes, oh, and it's surprisingly like good. Aeon's Gate's pretty sweet. It feels like I'm reading a D&D &D game. Only, you know, well written. Although, the first two chapters of the first book, which was like Book of the Undergates, I believe is what it's called. Book of the Undergates was a little weird. Commander. How did things go? He won't be bothering you anymore. Really? That's... I can't pay you for your help, but I can Oops. give you a discount on any supplies you purchase here. A thug said he worked for a man named Baines. Sound familiar? Baines? I wonder if he means Armiston Baines. We worked together a long time ago. What can you tell me about him? Last I heard, the Alliance military was contracting him for some research in the Traverse. We should follow up with Captain Anderson. We'll see what the captain can tell us. I wish I could tell you more. Is there anything else I can help you with, Commander? I'll be going now. Goodbye, Commander. Nice now, talking to you. Let's see if that discount yes, Commander. Is there something the I can do for you? Of the Let me take a look at what you have really for sale. Really nice item. Of course. It did not bring the price down. How dare you? But she did say I think she said she'd give me a better price, so I'll come back here and sell shit here. Yeah, that's my problem, is is the insane over-descriptive nature of, of Jordan. I just, I can't do it. I can't do it. Uh, where am I going? Uh, t -t -t embassies. King Killer's pretty good. Uh, I'm, I haven't reread them. I read the King Killer Chronicles years ago when they first popped up. Um, Sanderson's a good author. <laughs> um, I like Sanderson's stuff. However, I'm not necessarily a huge fan of the, um... God, the... Your Onoveria the, report raised I a few eyebrows in the council, Shepard. I can't believe you let that queen live. There's a reason their species was nearly wiped out. You should have finished them off. This queen isn't like the others. She's not interested in conquest or war. Really? I'm glad you're an expert in a species we know virtually nothing about. I hope we're both still around in 50 years to see if you're right. Genocide of an entire species is a terrible tragedy, Ambassador. Shepard did the right thing. Fine. I'll just tell everyone we figured it was a good idea to release a fertile Rachni queen in the wilds of Novaria. I'm sure nobody will have a problem with that. I swear to God, I want to punch you, Dina, every time he opens his mouth. I really yes, Commander. Really want to. What do you know about him. Armiston Baines? Where did you hear that name? Never mind. I don't want to know. Baines is dead. Has been for quite some time. The people I spoke with seem to think he was still alive. It's not common knowledge. Military is keeping it under wraps. Baines was doing some high-level work for the Alliance. Stuff even I wasn't aware of. One day he turns up dead on a drifting scout ship. Everyone suspects it was foul play, but it was never officially investigated. What can you tell me about the ship? I don't know much about it. You should talk to Admiral Kohoku. One of his crews discovered Baines' body. I spoke to Kohoku. He never brought it up. You should mention Baines the next time you see him. See if he'll tell you anything. Is there anything else, Commander? Nope, that was I should it. go. I'll be here if you need anything. That's right. You just stand there putting up with, uh, frickin' Udina. Yes, Udina has a very punchable face, but it's also just his general attitude. Like, he just, in general, irritates me. 
right, let's go talk to Kohaku. <laughs> a lot, a lot of walking for this one. Presidium, Citadel Tower. Let's go talk to Kohaku. That's right, it's around, and he's over there. Up, two, three, four, up, up, up. No, I'm waiting to. Commander, any luck finding my recon group? Captain Anderson said you had information on Baines. Not as much as I'd like to. One of my crews found him, frozen stiff on board a derelict vessel. The missing recon group? The one I sent you to find? They were scouting the system we found Baines' ship in. You should have mentioned this earlier, Admiral. Baines is already dead. It's too late for him. I'm only concerned about my team. Someone has to find them. Please, Shepard, I'm counting on you. Hmm. Alright. So, let's see. We got that, we got that. Alright, I need to take a short break. So, I will be right back. Enjoy uh, some music and some funny little videos and stuff. And I'll return in a moment. <laughs> 